growing. And now, Bay Ridge's answer to Howard Stern, Yvonne Dillette. Welcome, everyone. This is the second episode, episode de in French, in French, of the Unknown Zone Talk Show. Thank you. We made it to episode two. Woo! My nipples are hard right now. It's crazy. It's crazy. Uh, this is the show. I am your host, Yvonne Dillette, and this is the show that begs to ask the question, if you point one finger at me, how many middle fingers can I point back at you? I'm just saying. Oh, that was angry. Was that angry? That was a little boo. <laughs> I got booed already. That's so cool. Uh, you know, I was thinking of doing in the nicer version, which would have been, if, if you point one finger at me, uh, how many peace signs can I show you? No, not good. See, I tell you, you got to stay with the anger. Yeah, boo. No, worse boo. Worse boo. Awesome, awesome. Thank you for coming back. Um, if you if you saw the first show, I know we had at least 25 viewers. Keith and Dave. Right, Dave, all right? All right. And when I say Keith and Dave, I am referring to sloppy seconds. Sloppy seconds, all right? Which now, actually, you guys are not sloppy seconds. You, you've moved up in rank. But my question to you is, can you go from sloppy seconds to... Uh, first choice. Is that possible to go backwards like that? No, absolutely not. No. no. Okay, Dave's quiet. That is Thank shocking. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> that is shocking. Dave is quiet. I, I am. I am a. I live right for now. sloppy seconds, quite honestly. <laughs> there you go. That's the Dave I know. All right. All right. Now I wanted. You know, we had a little legal situation from the first show. A lot has transpired. A lot that you know from a public access show. I was a, little, a lot of drama. A lot of stuff. So these guys have signed contracts. They are now my comedy bitches. Yeah. All right. I gotta Tell add something bitches. to that contract. Yeah. Oh wait. What's the what's going on? You have demands. Demands that I have well, to add to my language. contract. Yeah. Demands. Really. Yes. Really. All right. Okay. Uh, Keith. Keith Atherton. Um. His demands are he wants whores and squirrels. Yes. Whores and squirrels. Interesting. That's it. I'm simple. Like simple. That. Simple guy with simple mm -hmm. taste. Now, Dave. Feel free to laugh. If you want a fake laugh, I'm okay with that. I'm just saying. <laughs> fake laughter works for me. Um. Dave wants whores and hamburgers. Whores and hamburgers. <laughs> it's kind of an obvious thing. I'm sorry, but you know, you're not thin. But anyway, that's the, who cares? Who cares? I was I was once chubby myself. Um, oh my God! Did everyone turn the channel once? yet? <laughs> I'm chubby still, and I'm proud of it. I'm proud of it. Any chubby chasers in the audience? Any chubby? <laughs> Got some chubby chasers. Allie, who did my makeup and did a fantastic job. I think I don't even look like myself, right? No, you don't. You didn't even know who I was when I walked in here. I thought you were Howard Stern. <laughs> a lot of people think I look like Howard Stern, except, especially because I have a small cock. Because I have a small, <laughs> have a small cock. And it's a cute. It's cute. It's cute. It's kind of like Chris Chins, but we'll talk about that later. <laughs> Um, that's one of our guests. This is going to be a different show. Woo! I got I got goose chills right now. Allie, who did my makeup and was the mime on the last show, her all her demand, all she says is that she just wants to thank you for letting me be on the show. For her to be on. Is that so sweet? Isn't that sweet? I just want to show you nothing on the on the paper, nothing on the paper. Thank you. All right. Thanks for the demands. Woohoo! Let's move on. All right. Um, People have commented. I had asked people to comment on the Facebook page. We got good reviews and bad. You heard? Do you guys? You heard some good stuff and bad stuff, right? Do you have any groupies, by the way? Any groupies? Uh, yeah, I had before the show. I had. Of course you did. Your eye candy. Yeah. 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 Did you get some before the show today? No. 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 Oh, that's sad. You made me wake up really early. <laughs> I know. Everybody's. Here. It's really late at night, though. It's really late at night, but it's actually not. Did you get any? You have any? They've been beating a path down to my door. And I, I've just recently run out of rubbers and roofies. <laughs> Really? Rubbers and roofies. That's going to be your new, new nickname. All right. I have a groupie and a stalker. I just want to say that. And that's all I'm going to say because it wasn't funny when I first said it, so why repeat it? <laughs> so, um, but I did, I did get, you know, there are people that like the show and didn't like the show. Like I said, um, uh, an old friend of mine, Ed the Beard, was not a fan of the show. No. Not a fan, no. No, my dad saw the show. My dad saw the show. He really liked it. He thought I handled the material, made everyone comfortable, and it made it seem effortless. However, we didn't talk about content. If anyone that saw the last show, there was a lot of, you know, uh, blue material. And um, but he did say, as a parent, he was very, he was concerned and upset that I'm not into blowjobs. He didn't know where he went wrong, as a parent. And you know, we're working through that. We're working through that. My therapist loved Dave, by the way. 
Let's not pass this thing with you. Your father is right on so many levels. It's what America needs more dads like your dad. Okay? Yeah. Well, when I was going down on him, Home he said way. it. So. <laughs> is that bad? Did I cross a line? Family values. <laughs> Did I cross a line? And my dad, dad, please, I, got, I can't, I gotta not let him watch this show. But Family values. Oh, right, Dave, 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 just play the fucking piano. <laughs> All right. All right. Now, now, we, since we, you know, it's public access, not a lot of people, like I said, 25, maybe more people, I don't know, saw the show. I am into the occult. I don't know if you knew that. I mean, I mean to thank you. <laughs> that, that's always worth a, a applaud. Um, and I did the Ouija board. I got some Ouija board reviews from people from history. Fascinating, right? Impressive. I actually I did the Ouija, I did the Ouija board, and Abe Lincoln saw the show. <laughs> Abe Lincoln saw. He said he loved the show, um, but he said uh, what other people think of me are, is none of my business, which I thought was very modern. A very modern statement. Um, it's almost like Dr. Phil, isn't he? Kind of is. Abe Lincoln, Dr. Phil, yeah. I thought that would get a bigger laugh, but that's all right. Um, <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, who is next on my list? Uh, Mussolini saw the show. Oh. Mussolini, yeah, not a fan. Oh. Did not like the show. But he did say he liked you, Keith, and he thought you should have your own show. I agree. <laughs> he thought, Mussolini and Keith. Chopin, Chopin saw the show. Who's that? Chopin is a uh, famous classical music conductor. Am I right, Dave? He is a oh, right up there. Right. He the loved you. Chopin loved you. He did say you had a little too much jibber jabber, though. Boring. A little too much. He was boring. You think? <laughs> no, he just said too much talking. Um, I agree with that shit too. Marcel Marceau saw the show. Saw the show. He didn't say had nothing to say. Ah, uh, no, <laughs> wah, 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 there's that sound, I got these, wah, we try to figure out where that sound comes from, wah, 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 that's an awesome sound, I love that sound. No, actually, he did comment in the show, and he loved, he loved um, the mime, he thought she was ahead of her time. <laughs> she was ahead of her time, thank you, I got a million of them, I got a million of them. I got a, unfortunately, I have some sad news, the mime um, has retired. Aww. So we won't have the mime. I know we won't have the mime on the show today, Aww. but we are looking for a temp mime, a replacement mime. So um, we'll see what happens with that. But I just say no. That's a sad moment, and I want to move past it because I'm sad right now. Um, as you can tell, I'm crying, crying inside. I'm crying in my vagina in this area. Um, <laughs> that time you got wet down there. I know it's so dry. <laughs> If anyone so that you that know how good. dry it is. Yeah. I'm actually cooking brunch. I got some eggs benedicts going on in there oh, today. Oh, yeah. 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 yeah oh. But no cream though. No cream oh. sauce because it's dry. Sour cream. Sour <laughs> cream. All right. And one more. You know, comedy usually comes in threes, but on this show we, we break all the limits. We're breaking all the comedy. So it's coming in fives because that was four. And the fifth one, Shakespeare saw the show. Wow. Shakespeare, I know. We need the teleprompter. Can you move? Because <laughs> uh, I, this I don't have by heart. What did the I don't bard have to say? The bard said... Talk about contact, when we're on, keep going, keep going, dad reviews. All right, yeah, keep going. <laughs> Ouija, I, this is great. It's a, wait, I'm gonna just take a nap. All right, um, Shakespeare said something, a little more, keep going, keep going, keep going. We can to edit this out anyway, it doesn't matter. La 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 la, almost there, almost there. Show us your tits almost while there. we're waiting. All right, here we go, okay, keep going, good. Now just keep going, okay. Shakespeare said, there is a, you can go a little faster, there is a tide in the affairs of men which taken at the flood leads on to fortune. Omitted, all the voyage of their life is bound in shallows and in miseries. On such a full sea are we now afloat, and we must take the current when it serves or lose our ventures. Thus, the Unknown Zone Show. The Unknown Zone Talk hey. Show. Huh? Hey. That's something. That's something. I'm, hear ye, hear ye. I have no idea what that means, but I think that's awesome. All right, you know what? I'm not going to talk too much. I'm not going to talk Yay. anymore. <laughs> you know, I did talk a long time in the first show because I had comedy blue balls because it took a year to make that show. Um, and I, oh, I thought that would get a big laugh. All right, so not at all. So we have guests tonight. I'm a big poker f uh, fan. I play a lot of poker. Um, and we're gonna, in I'm going to interview some poker people. So, yay, who are here waiting. They comprise most of the audience. Um, we're going to take a break. Now, public access does not have commercials, so what I'm going to do is we're going to cut, show a picture, and I'm going to, we're going to all move over to the, 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 the interview area. So thanks for being here, and we'll be back in uh, a picture. Yay!